Hey guys, and welcome to my April favourites. It is now the 1st of May, so I thought I would do my April favourites. Um, first of all, um, I have just done a makeup look for the first time in months. So, <coughs> once I've uploaded that, I shall link it in the down below bar. Um, but I'm a little bit rusty, so excuse me, I'm very sorry. Um, but it's kind of like this look. Um, I've had this look on for a little while now, so the colours aren't as kind of dramatic as they were. So, yeah, and obviously I've had to add my red lipstick. But other than that, yeah. So I'm just going to get started. Um, now, every time I film a favourite video, I'm on my an eyeing for ages. So, I've written everything down. Well, I think everything down. So hopefully it won't be a long video. Um, first of all is I just wanted to explain something. I normally only do my favourite videos like what I've been using that month. So even though I've had birthday presents that was like okay it was at the start of the month it was on 9th of April but I, I don't think I've given them like okay it was just makeup brushes and kind of stuff like that but I haven't given it like like everything so makeup brushes I got for my birthday yes I love them but they're gonna be in my next video my next favorite video anyway so I'm just gonna get started so first of all is ah well okay this is this is, this is gonna be a big huge butt here I only got this on like when did I even get this it was in the middle of it. So I got a pack of five um, US lip balms on like 15th of April, so in the start, but this is the one I've been using every day since the 15th of April. So I think that I can give it a, in my favourites, it's nearly done. Like considering what that looks like, and considering what a new one looks like, that's what a new one looks like, right? And that is what my one looks like. So as you can see, this has been well loved since the 15th of April. Um, I'm going to be sad to see this go, but there are the other flavours that I want to give a bash. But this is my so far so good flavour. You know like when you first discovered chapstick? Like as a kid, and you just want to apply it, apply it, apply it. Like my lips this month have been so soft, but I think it's just because I've been applying this stuff, like, like all over. Like just like, like yeah. I I seriously think like you know when you're a kid and you just discover chopstick for the first time, and you always put it on. Yeah, this is what this has turned into. But every, every time I pull it out, people are like, the hell is that? I'm like, it's my US lip balm! So, yes. Um, so, yeah. Sticking on with the lip product, it is... I've only got two thingies. Two, um... Two shades of this. Two colours, two shades, but it's the Rimmel Apocalypse um, Lip Lacquer. Um, I've got one in Stellar. So that is Stellar. I just love how like neon they are. Like that's the brush. And this one is in Big Bang. But yeah, so I've definitely, definitely been loving my lip lockers. Yeah. Um, but I just love how they go on like a lip, like a lip gloss, but then they stay like a lipstick. I love that. Um, so hopefully these two will not be lonesome for much longer because I really do want to try more colours 
out of this range. I don't really know what colours there are. Like I tend to stick to like kind of like this kind of colours, like reds. So it'll be interesting. But anyway, so. Another lip product thing is just a MUA red um red um lip liner. I just find that if I put this on first and then I put on like a lipstick or something, it just makes my lipstick stay a little bit longer. And then two of the Topshop crayons are Secret Party, it's kind of a, a glittery kind of one, which is like gold shimmer, it's not even going to show up, but yeah you can kind of see the glitter, but I wish I had found this at Christmas, like this would have been my Christmas lip. Like, I would have worn this all through December if I had known there was one like this. But I just find it kind of hard to pull off like, a glittery kind of red lip. Or I've got Royal, which I've had before. I had this at Christmas. And this one is just more of a, kind of a matte red. Um, but what I like about these lip crayons is that it can build the intensity of the colour like if you just put it on a little bit it's just a nice flush of colour but if you keep applying it it will go on like a lipstick but you've got to kind of put on a few coats of it and last but not least is I think this is in ev every favourite I've ever had so far it's the MUA Hair Lipstick And it looks like that. I love how my hand is just all red. Like, I love it. Um, but yeah. Now I knew I was going to get brushes for my birthday. But my Sigma brushes were starting to look a little bit dull. And shedding. So. And then the powder brush. I just love how big this one is. Like I can be like boom, 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 boom. It's, I just love how fluffy and big it is. Oh no. Oh, yeah. And then I got my angled brush. Do my blush. And then last but not least is the Real Techniques part of part blush brush I say and it's just nice to put on my blush so yeah next is um, a game on my phone um, if you're wondering I've got the Samsung Galaxy S3 but if you're wondering and I'm sorry about my case but I get bored and the first thing to hand is just to pick off the gems as you can see I picked them all off here and here and here. But anyway, that is besides the point. Um, right. I've been meaning to do this in another favourites. Um, like I've been meaning to do it for a couple of months now. But it's the Simpsons Tapped Out game. Um, I'll just kind of show you kind of like the game, and like I put up the volume. Maybe I'll turn down the volume. Um, but basically, you've got Springfield, which you can make your own, and kind of like. Let me try and track down some. Oh, like there's Marge, there's Millhouse, and there's snakes, and there's like the plant, and like. School, Willie's Hut, kind of like the church, um, Krusty Burger, and so 
I love The Simpsons, so obviously I love this game. Um, and I have been using it for a couple of months now. I just forgot to add it into my previous favourites. Um, but yeah. And I think you can get that on Apple as well. I'm not too sure. I know you can get it on Android, but I'm not too sure about Apple. But I don't see why you can't get it on Apple. Um, and then my favourite movie has been Pitch Perfect. Um, I only started watching this maybe like last week when it came on the Sky Movies. Um, but I watched it at least twice a day. This is how much I'm obsessed with this movie. I love this movie. I love it. 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 And one of my favorite songs is at the end when the Bellas are singing their last song, and that's kind of like one of the songs I've been playing like constantly, like to the point where I know all the words and it's kind of bad. But oh wow! Well. Love it. Love it. Love it. I just wish I got to see this in the cinema. None of my friends wanted to go and see it, so I had to get it. On, I had to wait till I got it on DVD. But yeah, if you've not seen this movie, go get it. So to look, go along with that kind of thing, I've got three favorite songs. Um, "Want You Back" by um, Cher Lloyd, and then "Cell Block the uh, Cell Block Tango" um, by Chicago. It's not really by Chicago, I don't think. Well, obviously. Well, the character is singing in Chicago, um, but anyway, um, and then April is like one of the biggest month for TV shows coming back into, um, back into like play or whatever. So I've had three favorite shows so far: Awkward, The Borgias, um, Awkward Borgias. Oh, the valleys, which came on last night. Oh my God, what the hell's going on with the valleys? <gasps> um, if you watch the valleys, please comment below and tell me everything what you thought about last night. Um, I was like, like the amount of times I laughed out loud. Like, I haven't laughed out loud to a program in so long. But last night watching the valleys, I thought. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, please see they're not doing that. I was like watching see like that, like that. Like, oh my god, oh my god. But yeah, so I love the valleys. Um, and then, so you've got Awkward, Borgias. Um, I don't really know what else. I'm trying to think. Um, and then, when I just kind of discovered this TV show. I already knew it existed, because I've seen the promos for it, and I was like, not really my type of TV show, but I kind of was watching it at the start of the month, and I kind of got sidetracked by the by the um, TV show, and that is Dance Moms or Moms. It was M O M, like American style for mom, but as Dance Moms. But anyway, like I seen it advertised when it first came out. In the UK, that is. Um, I'm like, like I've I watched like the first like ten minutes of the first episode. I was like, I can't be bothered watching this. But I watched it halfway through. Um, on one of the, I think it was like tenth episode or something. Um, I never know if it was. Um, the tenth episode. Maybe it was even like younger than that. But anyway, so it's like. Oh my god, this TV show is so good! Ah! But, yeah. Um, so I think that's about it for my April favourites. Let me know what you've been loving in the down below bar. And I shall see you in my next video. Bye guys!